Hi kids, wanna learn some useful facts? Too bad, cause in this video I'll be talking about 100 of the most useless facts in iPixel Skyblock. Necron is actually an orphan, as his parents were game ended. Some say it was done by the Wither King K-Man. If you use the F7 RNG meter and pick Necron's handle, even if you do 10 minute runs, including downtime you should be able to make 9 mil per hour, without considering the other drops. Bonzo was a circus clown. Scarf was the top student of his class. Professor was the professor. And Levitt was a murdering psychopath. You can find an NPC called Trinity in Dungeons. She sells Speed 5 Region 5 ports for 100k and Region 9 ports for 10 million. You can complete the wizard's quest by bringing him the crystal that can be found here. He'll give you a blessing of wisdom. There is an item called Trip with a Lord Sword in the Essence Guide, which is not yet obtainable. The Dark Claymore is a reference to the anime Berserk, where the main character has a massive sword. A lot of people use max or armor in dungeons for speed, which may reduce their damage. So instead of using max sword, you can use an equipment with the speed attribute. If you take more than 70 minutes to complete a dungeon run, it automatically fails you. You can actually see the M7 Phase 5 Arena in F7, if you break the blocks. You can get Co-op Soulbound Mineral Armor if you use Starred Hardened Diamond Armor. Having a dungeon sack with full inventory can delete secrets. This room in dungeons has always had 3 secrets, but it says 3 out of 1 secrets. Floor 7 RNG meter requires more runs to get recomp compared to F3 as there is more loot variety. The Mender Crown made a surprising comeback after the Skyblock levels update, with the addition of the Mending stat, which made it better than the Reaper Mask. The highest Kata player right now is Voice, with Kata 70, or more than 3 billion Kata XP which should take around 60 million entrance runs. Only OGs will remember, the foraging islands were smaller and were called floating islands. They looked like this. This is what they look like now. Feel old yet? Before the bazaar existed, you could buy infinite number of items from the NPC, but I prefer the new way. As the old way was. Somebody stop that racket! The hub island was changed from this to this. You could gain actual overflow mana, which allowed for a bunch of exploits, namely the immortal goblin strat. Back in the day, we didn't share loot. Like a dirty com. Only the strong would survive. Back then, you could switch your sword for a beyond insane damage boost. Back then, we didn't have quick swords, cause attack speed didn't even work. Making 1 million per hour was god tier. Doing over 100,000 damage was only possible through exploits. Clay and magma cube minions were the best. Back then, you couldn't just give coins from the trade menu. You had to bid in their auction. Unlike the plebs these days. The Colosseum actually worked, and people would fight there abusing the new best weapon. Most people would build massive cobblestone generators for mining XP. There was a time when gassed minions could be farmed AFK for combat XP. Sven used to be the hardest boss in the game as it would deal true damage. So people had to use the terrain to their advantage. You would be banished to the shadow realm if you had any of these enchants in your gear. Bald Guy Ace's guide on enchanting your books properly was one of the most useful guides out there. Instead of buying a god pot, people had to stand in line to get splashed. Farming was the best way to make money in Skyblock. Slayers would be made fun of for how much of a time sink it was. Don Expresso is an NPC that appears during the Mithril Gormand event. His name is likely a reference to the admin Don Piresso. A lot of admins have OP admin only gear like Enchanted Clock, Ray Gun, Armor of the Stars. Sword of the Stars, Mega Jerry Lure. As you can see, most of the items are really OP, 
But there is an item like the Titan's Armor, which is weaker than most endgame armor sets, and even some mid-game. There are currently 4 players with the game Annihilator. Forager Simple, John Wick, Time Dio, and Inhumanly. Hypixel is owned by Riot Games, which is owned by Tencent. That also owns League of Legends, PUBG, and Valorant. Hypixel started as a YouTube channel uploading Minecraft adventure maps. Hypixel anti-cheat devs make 70k to 100k per year. Miniclu had osteosarcoma and got his last chemo on March 2022. Speaking of Miniclune, he has an alt called Megaclune that changes its skin from time to time. Some players use it to guess what the next update may be. It's been 4 years since Hytale was announced. Hasco's MVP plus rank was removed in September 2020. Javerman's Twitter profile picture is the sandworm from Dune. Hypixel used to have a server in China, but was shut down as the original agreement had expired. Some Hypixel admins that left in 2022 are Deuces, Doctor and Jacob Ruby. If Elon Musk were to use his entire net worth to buy Skyblock coins, he would have around 231 quadrillion coins. The blocks spawned by Mithril minions don't drop anything if you mine them manually. Blaze, Inferno, and Voidling minions are the only minions that can drop dies. Parrot pets repeat the messages of ranked players. Increasing a minion's level upgrades its held tool. You cannot blow up an open chest. There is a dual arena under the Skyblock hub, even though it can't be accessed anymore. There is also a painting area for ranked players. If you kill a zombie with a regular sword, it gives 2 coins. But if you use your fist, it gives 1 coin. The Witch's Mask is the best item to farm sneaky creepers for the bestiary. You can get the travel scroll to the hub castle from the lonely philosopher. Amelia is actually Dora, from Dora the Explorer. Minions have unique dialogues. Here are a few interesting ones. If you burn a minion, it recreates the meme. Mushroom minions can sometimes trip on their own shrooms. They also react to mobs near them, like rabbit or spider. You can see all the old islands from the deep caverns. The wild strawberry dye is the rarest item in the game, with a 1 in 150 million drop chance from harvesting crops. But technically, the Celadon die is the rarest item in the game, with a 1 in 1 billion drop chance from small sludges. But it has a 1 in 20 million drop chance from large sludges. But even then, the rarest chance of something happening in the game is the shiny yellow rock procking, as it has a 1 in 1 trillion chance to proc. The Flag Blast's health was nerfed from 1 billion to 500 million on April 25th, 2022. If you give 4,200,000, 2,022 coins to the Kudra Believer with a Fleck Blast next to it, it gives you Herring the Fish. Speaking of the Kudra Believer, if you give him 1 million coins, you can spawn the Weird Sailor in the Kudra boss fight area. If you fish next to the Weird Sailor with an Elegant Tux, a Respiration 1 Bonzo Mask, and Ice Bait, you can drop the Wet Napkin. Speaking of the Wet Napkin, there are 29 hidden Among Us characters in it. Forest can be found in Dragon Tail. It is a reference to Forest from Forest Gump. You need to deal at least a million damage to Vanks to get stars from it, unless you're the one who spawned it. The drops of Crimson Isle's mini bosses isn't affected by Magic Find. Mad Sticks cannot break blocks for some reason, but Redstone Torches can. Flares are the best way to gain combat XP in Skyblock, but are really stressful. At 7k mage reputation, you can fight Chickzilla for a 100 mage reputation. If you want to find Lord Jabas or Thunder, you should go to the main island spawn in the Crimson Isles, then follow the players who were recently killed. You can find Cinder Bats in the Crimson Isles, that can be farmed to craft the best permanent fuel in the game. You need over 57 million magic find with looting 5 to get the flame die every kill. Blazes in the Kudra boss fight deal increased damage the more they hit a player. The blazes also don't care about your iframes. You can find white smoke particles in the volcano. That is where you can catch steaming hot flounders. There is a secret lab in the Crimson Isles with an evil man. There are only two NPCs in the game with names that start from the letter Z, that are Zog and Ziri. 
If you have red sand minions and switch to the mage faction, they'll call you a traitor. Same works for mycelium minions. You just spent too much time watching a video of a guy talking about random useless stuff. How do you feel? Tell me in the comments. Now I gotta finish my outro. If you watched the video, this point is there. Thank you if you want to watch more videos like this. Click the button on the left. If you want to continue watching more content, click the button on the right. If you want to support the channel, consider being a channel member or major on the Discord. I don't really leave a comment as I read all comments.